right-handed people dominate the world, and it's been that way since the Stone Age. Researchers figured it out by measuring the arm bones in ancient skeletons and by examining wear patterns in prehistoric tools. In Western countries, lefties make up only about 10% of the population. Folks who favor different hands for different tasks or who use both hands with equal skill are uncommon. Scientists have long known that handedness is partly shaped by genes. So handedness is probably hardwired before birth. Many kids continue to switch hands for different tasks during early childhood. Your brain's right side controls muscles on the left side of your body and largely drives musical and spatial abilities. That may be why left-handers often hold more than their share of slots in creative professions. In right-handed seniors, researchers found that the subjects relied less and less on their dominant hand the older they got. As their right hands grew slower and unsteady, the elderly people handled some of the tasks just as well with their left hands. Ambidexterity is the ability to use both the right and left hand equally well. Since many everyday devices are asymmetrical and designed for right-handed people, many left-handers learn to use them right-handedly due to the rarity or lack of left-handed models. Thus, left-handed people are more likely to develop motor skills in their non-dominant hand than right-handed people. Right-handedness is the most common form, and it is estimated that around 90% of the world's population is right-handed. Handedness is often defined by which hand one writes with, as it is fairly common for people to prefer to do some tasks with each hand. However, true mixed handedness is rare, with most people preferring one hand for most purposes. Most of the current research will suggest that left handedness has an epigenetic marker, a combination of genetics, biology and the environment. Right handedness is by far the most common type. Right-handed people are more skillful with their right hands when performing tasks. Left-handedness is far less common than right-handedness. Left-handed people are more skillful with their left hands when performing tasks. Studies suggest that approximately 10% of the world population is left-handed. Cross-dominance or mixed-handedness is the change of hand preference between tasks. This is very uncommon in the population with about a 1% prevalence. Ambidexterity, equal ability to use both hands, is rare. A completely ambidextrous person is able to do any task equally well with either hand. Those who learn it still tend to favor their originally dominant hand. There are several theories of how handedness develops in individual humans. Researchers studied fetuses in utero and determined that handedness in the womb was a very accurate predictor of handedness after birth. Since in most people the left side of the brain controls speaking, right-handedness predominates. This theory also predicts that left-handed people have a reversed brain division of labor. Left-handed individuals have a heterogeneous brain organization in which their brain hemispheres are either organized in the same way as right-handers or even such that both hemispheres are used for verbal processing, 